step outside yourself and no matter how hard it is for yourself just just try to do something beyond your own issues you know just when you think you just have all these problems in the world you meet someone who is dealing with a terminal child and it's it's so important anyway Dale had a seizure and it was a, just a few seconds long they said his eyes rolled he lost all the color in his face and he kind of passed out um, and then he was really tired and fell asleep after that for a while came home and he was just tired but in a normal mood seemed to be um, see it it's right here this is your gift Kristen Martin she's in the bag I promise you she's in there see <laughs> she is there's mine there's yours. <laughs> I just haven't gotten a chance to put it in a box and send it to you, but she's coming, I promise. I'm sorry it's taking so long. I'm, I'm just, some things get done and some things get. It's just you and me, little black Catan. How's my friend? Huh? Oh, his hair's getting long. Maybe we'll let you grow long for the winter. You have to let me brush you, though, little fresh. Yes, you do. Hi. Doesn't he love? I love you. He's a good boy. This is a good boy. So many people say, how could a Catan be black? Here's one. Truly, he's not all black, actually. The white is trying to come in all over his body, and his nose is brown. And here's the white. There's his white. His little paws are white too. Or they were when he was puppy. He's a little bit. He's a good boy. Yes, he is. He's a good, good boy. He likes a rubber tummy. Yes, he does. Yes, he does, little Henry. Huh. Look at him. Did he sweep like this? <laughs> Henry. <laughs> hey. He loves Fridays with Mom. Huh. Maybe after my therapy appointment, we'll go for a walk. A W A L K. I can't say it out loud or he'll start to think it's happening this very second. Right, Hen? The blood's going to rush to your head, bud. Yes, the under here is like a brownish color and it's around his nose. You're silly. I love him. He's so cute. Do you have a black katan? I'm trying to find someone out there else who like has a black katan. I know it's crazy, but every time I see someone here and they say, oh, what kind of dog is that? And they say, katan. They say, oh, I thought they were white. <laughs> like, it's just so often the conversation that follows, what kind of dog is he? He's a katan de tulier. Oh, I thought they were white. No, not all of them. <laughs> No, them are white. No, they come in very many. So I'm in the brand new day. It's Friday and I am late for therapy. Um, I kind of fell back asleep. Go ahead, Henry. 
I did set the alarm. I got up, but I'm just like, yeah. Oh man, so here I sit. <clears throat> I'm going through all of my drawers and my file drawers, going through all of my old papers, cleaning it out, and I'm going to call each and every one of my, each and every one of my utilities and bills, starting with the biggest and working my way down, and see if there's anything we can do to save money. Um, and that's good, you know. But as I'm sitting here, I just got a phone call and Daniel had a seizure at school. <sighs> so I have to get on the line with the doctor and go have his blood work drawn. But right now I have to pick up Thomas. We need to drop off his, um, a bunch of other uh, instruments, three, not a bunch, uh, an amplifier and two instruments that he had downstairs that we just hadn't brought over to the middle school after summer because of the hospitalization and then they're huge so we need to use the big van to think something really cool Facebook happened today gently um, used special needs equipment and Daniel has quite a bit of that in the basement that he no longer fits into or is able to use so um, I finally got motivated enough to try to clear that stuff out because I really want to clean out the basement I put on there uh, his what they call a positioning chair and there's a picture of it. it's like a wooden chair and it's very very nice it's adaptable and it tilts and it has wheels on it and it comes with a tray so the person um, can sit in it and have a tray table right up to them and it and it adapts to their need to be reclined or not etc this chair is about fifteen hundred dollars new uh, if you buy it from prospect designs uh, they won't cover it they just they don't consider it a necessary medically necessary piece of equipment. So a woman contacted me from, um, very interested in the chair because she too had been trying to get a chair for her little five-year-old who has a, it's called Luca dystrophy and basically the white matter is, uh, degenerates or the child's, the child's, I don't know the exact uh, definition of the disease, but he is um, terminal. His prognosis is not good um, and he's five, but uh, she expressed an interest in the chair, so she came out here today, and it was such a blessing to meet her. Like, I, I just had one of those moments where I, I wanted to burst out crying because she asked me about my story, and of course my journey is a lot longer um, than hers is, but boy, to, ha to have a little one like that, and then they had to, I guess, just been trying to get a chair like this and just had been denied, 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 denied. So, and she's on the Katie Beckett waiver waiting list, just like we were back when Daniel was little, because everything's so expensive. And she's like, oh my God, it's just so hard. Diapers, everything. Um, I wish I could have just given it to her, which is what I really wanted to do. But then she's like, here, I'm just going to give you $40 for it. And I took the money only because I really needed it. Got a almost brand new positioning chair like that that would be fifteen hundred dollars new um, and I just it is in great shape I mean, it looks brand new so she seems so happy and it just it, I don't know it made my day like and I'm kicking myself because I'm like Julie that stupid chair was in the basement for years what's wrong with me like so now I want to go down there and get the other thing out and it's a walker um, I'm giving away his swing, although the person didn't come to pick it up. That one, I'm, I'm just like, just take it. So, I don't know. <laughs> I'm all over the place, right? I just, it's just sometimes you just gotta step outside yourself, and no matter how hard it is for yourself, just, just try to do something beyond your own issues, you know? Just when you think you just have all these problems in the world, you meet someone who is dealing with a terminal child and it's it's so important that if you get a make-a-wish you can also possibly qualify for a dream come true wish later on um hopefully he he makes it you know that long so that she can enjoy uh what their wish is so all right i have to go now to pick up thomas at the high school and go deliver a van chuck full of and he says yes 
Okay. So I just dropped Thomas off. His, see, this is the thing that's really cool about the band kids. They do stuff like just all getting together to play football or not all, but a good chunk of them. Certain sections are playing frisbee and football. <laughs> He's out there. He's out there. There he is. He's going to kill me if I'm videotaping him. Say goodbye, Thomas. He's out there. Anyhow, they're playing frisbee and football. And I have like 40 minutes. What am I going to do in 40 minutes? Go home, come back, I guess. This was just a weird kind of day today. It's um, Friday night. Started off my day with therapy. I didn't vlog very much because I was like not feeling well earlier and then quite stressed out about money and bills and the dog and Thomas and band and uh, the most important one being Daniel. Daniel had a seizure at school and it scared me. Here, oh, my lights pretty. I love my lights. Sometimes I turn them on for mood. I got them at Target. They're like little lights. I got these a while ago, but I don't always turn them on. It's just that sometimes they they make me feel good. That and my flamingo <laughs> makes me happy, especially in the winter. I don't know. Be the change you wish to see in the world. As always, tomorrow. Um, I was sleeping in the chair downstairs. Anyway, Daniel had a seizure, and it was a, just a few seconds long. They said his eyes rolled, he lost all the color in his face, and he kind of passed out. Um, and then he was really tired and fell asleep after that for a while. Came home and he was just tired, but in a normal mood, seemed to be. <laughs> so I had that and just trying to figure everything out. It's like so hard when nothing, nothing floats. And then you have to like manage all these other things in and about it. I wish I could provide everybody with every level of comfort that I could and take care of every need and I can't. I have to, um, oops, do the best I can. I, I don't know, I'm random. I don't know. You want to go to sleeps? All right, so that's um, kind of what's going on. John's already in bed. The boys have to get up early. Um, Thomas has to go to the high school. They have practice all day tomorrow and they have their first band competition in Bethel um, at Bethel High School. But it's supposed to rain tomorrow night, so if it's raining, I'm not sure that I'm going to bring Daniel out, um, only because we've just not been the healthiest people lately, so I don't know. But we have a lot of shows coming up, so we'll go to most all of them. Um, anyway, that's four that things that I need to cheer me up and inspire me. Things. They need some more new ones. I made it in the winter. Now I have to do more of. I bought that beautiful flute and I don't even play it. What is wrong with me? I should be playing music. That would make me feel so much happier. Alright. That and going to Florida, but I don't know if that's going to ever happen. Anyway. Full of love. No shortness of love. Love, 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 love. I love you. <laughs> I do. I love you guys. You guys are awesome. Like, I get the best compliments and the be not compliments, comments and responses and encouragement from you people. <laughs> from my friends out there, from my friends on Facebook, some of you cross over. I love people that subscribe to the blog. I love to subscribe to other people's vlogs. As a matter of fact, I subscribe to many, many, many. So keeping up with them is difficult. So I think what I'm going to do is just start like divvying them up. <gasps> hey, if you have a lot of subscriptions that you that you want to keep, how do you watch them all? I mean, I know you probably don't watch them all at once, but do you have a system for that? Because I think, I think I'd like to do that. I mean, I have some that are my favorites, which I want to do shout outs. Well, anyway. <gasps> Henry's barking at me because I'm talking, because see, he wants me to go to bed. Um, there's Daniel. Oh, i got to plug in the monitor. It's not on yet. There's the monitor. It's 
kind of loud, but I have to keep it loud so I can hear him breathing. If I can't hear him breathing, then I have to sleep in the chair downstairs tonight because I'm worried about seizures, but I'm sure that'll calm down. So that being said, oh, Kristen, um, Kristen Martin, I do have your gift. See it? It's right here. This is your gift, Kristen Martin. She's in the bag. I promise you. She's in there, see? <laughs> she is. There's mine. There's yours. <laughs> I just haven't gotten a chance to put it in a box and send it to you, but she's coming, I promise. I'm sorry it's taking so long. I'm, I'm just, some things get done and some things get piled up, but it's, it's definitely gonna come to you. There's the bag, isn't that cute? There she is, she is, she says. She says, she says to you, I'm worth the wait, Kristen, I'm coming. <laughs> okay. Go to bed, Henry. Good night, all. Thank you. Thank you so much. There was a few of you out there who really had a crazy mood on Facebook today. I was like, oh my God, I don't know who I am sometimes. I just go into this place of panic. Uh, and so many people just, just, just takes a little thing sometimes just to turn you around. And I needed that. So, peace out. Here's my boy. Here's Henry. He's my friend. He's the best. I love my dog. I do. I love him. He loves me.